nothing. And then, there was everything. When different notes find a common string, the music is simply magical. When separate colors dance into heavenly shades, the purity is shin white. When diverse emotions mingle, the fusion is humanity. When different cultures blend, the result is a lasting civilization. When people learn to live with each other, the harmony is eternal. When Ibrahim Qutub Shah the king heard about his son's love for a beautiful Hindu girl, he thought it was but a passing fantasy, an infatuation of the Eve. But then one day, there was a storm. The river Musi was in flood. Mohammed Kuli Qutub Shah, however, wanted to meet his lady love and could not be denied. Braving all danger, the young prince swam across the turbulent waters. Bhagamati was ecstatic, but the king was appalled. He immediately ordered that a bridge be built across the river Mosi. And it is that bridge of love that is today called Purana Pur. The love story between Muslim monarch and Hindu commoner has a wonderful envy. They got married and lived happily ever after. But not before they gave the Deccan the gift of her name. As a token of his love for his bride, Muhammad Kuli Qutub Shah first called the city Bhagyavadi. When after marriage she was christened Hedar Mahal, the city was renamed Hyderabad. The construction of the city started with a charminar, which was to be its centerpiece. Four roads were to radiate from this magnificent monument towards the north, east, west and south. The road to the west led to the famous Golconda Fort. Hyderabad started